You have heard about speed dating. It is when people attend an event when they have a few minutes to talk to a person they might be interested in dating. And then the bell rings and they move on to the next person. Demonstrating interest in a college is much the same concept. You have short periods of opportunity during which you can tell a college you are available. Showing interest is not a shortcut to admissions. Still, it will help you gather more information on the school, possibly be qualified for merit aid, and to show the school that you have qualities that might not come across in the admissions process. So, why is demonstrating interest essential? It truly is much like dating. It would help if you gave your prospective partner the understanding that they are important, that you are attracted to what they offer. In the college selection speed dating world, you want to learn all you can about the college. If you find there is not a good match, move on. But if there is a good feeling about the school, keep learning more. Hi, I'm Margaret Meek, and this is How to Date Your Prospective Colleges. So here are a few quick words of caution. As with any relationship, you need to make sure you aren't too needy. There are thousands of colleges, hundreds will meet your needs, and dozens will be a good fit for your education, finances, and personal life. You also want to ensure that your qualifications fall into the zone of selection for that campus. If there is a GPA or test threshold you don't meet, move on to a school that is a better match. Make sure you are honest with what you want, who you are, and what you have to offer. Ask many questions related to the program you want to study, student life, resources available to students, the cost of school, and the application process. Listen to the responses you receive. As with any relationship, a give and take is essential. Demonstrate that you are learning about that campus. Talk about what attracts you to the school. And don't be a creeper. There is no need to stalk the school or any of its representatives. How can you demonstrate interest? Through rounds of letting the college know you would like to learn more about them. Remember, in each case, you can stop communicating with any school if you determine that the school will not make your final list for applications. Let the school know that you have made other choices and move on. One of the keys to speed dating is to gather bits of information in a short time frame. So your information gathering on each college will come in short well-planned bits of reconnaissance. List those schools on any testing you do if they let you identify a college that interests you. Let the schools know you are working to gain entrance. If you have social media accounts, follow the school's admissions office, the school itself, or any other account that will help you better understand each campus's pace, priorities, and benefits. You can occasionally contact them through media, but only if you have something to say not just to get attention. Attend any summer camps offered by the school or academic college that interests you. You get experience on the campus, they get to know what you offer. Visit the campus, check in with the admissions office to sign up for tours and let them know you're interested in attending that school. You can also visit the office of the academic department you are interested in. Bring your list of questions that will provide the information necessary for you to choose whether or not to commit to completing an application. Check on the admissions website to see if there is an interest form you can complete to let the admissions officer for your high school's geographic location know that you are demonstrating your interest in the campus. If there is no interest form, contact the admissions counselor for your high school. Each college will break the U.S. into regions and assign counselors to each area. Email your region's counselor to let them know you're interested and to ask questions you have about that college. If your high school's counseling office offers college admissions counselors space at the high school to meet with students, make an appointment with the representatives of the schools that interest you. This is another opportunity to get your questions answered and to make an impression. Attend college fairs and speak with the representatives for each school that interests you. Introduce yourself, ask questions, and put a face to your name. If you receive emails or communication from these schools, open them. If a response is requested, respond. If an action needs to be taken, take that action. 
As you know with dating, nothing kills the potential more than a lack of response. Use your Naviance, Common Application, Coalition Application, or other such college application accounts to list any schools you are interested in. If you know a graduate or current student at that school, let them know of your interest and ask for their advice as you move forward. If they offer you the chance to meet with others who have a history with the school, please take advantage of that opportunity. This is a chance to learn what is important to the school and those who have a vested interest in its future. And as with speed dating, it is up to you to narrow your focus on which matches interest you the most. If you find no future with the school, leave them behind. Review what you still have available, widen the field if necessary, then determine if other potential matches are available for your educational future. When you finally know all you need to know about each school and have finished your final list of colleges, begin your applications. Utilize the early application and early decision processes to make sure there is no question that you want to solidify your relationship with that or those schools. As always, be responsible. Show yourself in a good light, ask questions if you don't know the answers, and work to show that you are a student who wants to learn and will be an asset to that school. None of the steps in this college search speed dating game takes much time or commits you to anything, but it does let the school know that you like them and all of us like to be liked. Take the steps necessary to provide information to the schools that interest you. Actively demonstrate that you are ready for the next step in your school-student relationship. If you found any of this information useful, hit the like button or perhaps consider subscribing. And if you have any questions, let us know in the comments below.